Hello, welcome back to my YouTube. I vlogged from Hawaii and I just loved getting back into it, so I'm gonna keep it up. I'm gonna make it more of a, of a habit. There's Mark coming back in the door there now. Um, I'm home, I'm jet lagged, extremely jet lagged. We woke up at like 12 and I've already fallen asleep on the couch. Uh, I'm playing kind of catch up today, doing washing, um, catching up on work, uh, repacking, because I'm actually going to Marrakesh on Tuesday uh, with YSL, so that would be a nice trip but there's a lot on at the moment it's back with a bang but i'm happy out um i'm just trying to keep on top of everything else while i'm going because i have a lot of things in the works at the moment just to kind of fill you in um clue is going planning for summer i've lots of designs in the works and it takes so long i also have a wine spritzer coming out this month and we're supposed to be launching that like literally like two weeks so trying to get everything over the line for that um what else? Oh yeah, I'm working on a podcast, which is really exciting. So I actually haven't even told anybody this online. So it's kind of like an extension of my book club. So I've been working on that. We shot the pilot for that two weeks ago. Um, so I'm lining guests up for that and trying to stay on top of my reading and stuff. So yeah, it's very busy. I have a lot going on at the moment and then the traveling in between. But I love traveling. I just love it. I love going to new places and kind of seeing what life is like over there and I love being in the sun <laughs> who doesn't um but yeah hopefully we get a nice week here in Ireland soon I am going to head back out to Mark and catch up with him and I will check in with you in a while we're going for dinner tonight actually so I'll show you what I'm wearing and where we're going and stuff Okay, I literally sat on the couch all day, in and out of naps. <laughs> but we're heading out for dinner now, we're going for tapas. And I'm wearing this fab dress. I actually really, really like it. I love the color, I don't have anything this color. And the kind of detail here, the way it comes a little bit longer. It is from Misguided, I will link in the description. And also my shoes are from there too. I got so much wear out of them in Hawaii. They're a really nice kind of summer sandal. So I'll link those in the description too. Good morning, it's Monday. We had such a nice night last night. Went for tapas in the market bar. I'll put in a, a little video here of the food. And then we went for like a few drinks afterwards. It was just nice to like hang out because I was away all last week and then I'm away this week when I'm supposed to be. I don't know if I have a sore throat or if it's my wisdom tooth, but I'm paranoid now. I have my PCR today anyway, so I'll know. But um, I'll, I'll let you know how it goes. I am just catching up this morning, catching up on emails. I have content to shoot, so I'm doing that now. And I have a meeting at 10 as well, so I'm kind of running around today to get organized. Okay, quick change. Just did a quick natural makeup look and I'm heading down to meet Melissa who has been doing the social media for Clue. So she's heading off for the summer so I'm gonna go meet her before she leaves. Guys, look at how big our sunflower has gotten. Can you see this? Like it's literally about, it's, I'd say it's five foot tall now. So exciting, I can't wait for it to flower. Okay, I really do have to go, but um, yeah, I'll bring you along with me. My PCR test is done. I'm gonna go to see if I can find something to wear because I just got the itinerary and there's a dress code. I need to wear something black, and most of my summer stuff isn't black. Oh my god, I cannot do this. I cannot vlog and walk on the street. <sighs> Mortified. Oh my god, guys, what is going on with the weather? It was sunny and now it's lashing rain. This has got to be like the wettest May we've had in a lot, like in at least a couple of years. But anyway, I got um, I got some black bits for Marrakesh, and I actually remembered I have a black dress at home that I've been saving, so I think I'm sorted. So all we need now is the negative PCR test. So hopefully, 
Okay, the time has come to sort this out and start packing. I got this little light thing for Hawaii for when it's dark. You know, like sometimes when you take a picture with your flash and it just comes out all like kind of too bright or something. So I got this and it's actually really good. But yeah, I'm gonna sort out this washing, try on the outfits I bought and I have some other bits that I wanted to show you too that are kind of new. So I'll link them all in the description. Okay, this is one of the dresses I got. I don't think I like it. These straps keep falling down. Ugh. And I feel like I can't tighten them because they're attached to the dress. I don't know. I'm annoyed now because I had like a midi one, but I put it down. I feel like I should have gone with that. It's like 30 something degrees over there, so it's gonna be really warm. Do you know what I hate though? It's like when you buy something and you queue up, I queued up for like 20 minutes and it's gonna be like, I'm gonna have to do the same to return it, you know? But anyway, what do you think of this one? Okay, this is cute. This could potentially be like a nice daytime outfit. I got a different top as well, so I'll try that on, but like I feel like the shorts would be needed if it's so hot over there. Um, yeah, like this. Okay, and then I got this bodysuit, which I feel like is a good buy. I feel like I'll wear that with jeans or like leggings, and it works well with the shorts as well. Swimsuit wise, this is what I'm gonna bring. Um, because the dress code is black. I actually love this, I wore it in Hawaii. And then this uh, sarong, which I know they can be really hard to find. I got a few nice ones on Misguided. So I'll link this one in the description and I'll show you another one I got as well. It's a uh, cream. Okay, this is the other sarong that I got and I actually love it. It's a little bit longer and I've already washed it. Washes really well. And I also wore it in Hawaii. The bikini top is from Misguided too, so I'll link that as well. I also got this dress from Misguided, which I think will just be lovely for like a summer dinner. I love the cutout details at the side. In the back, it's pretty flattering too. And it's a really nice length, if you're anyway tall like me. Oh, I'm wearing the same shoes I was wearing yesterday, the ones I got loads of wear out of in Hawaii. They're like literally just the perfect summer sandal and they're not super high either. So that suits me, I'd say they're about four inches. Okay, I have one more beach cover up I want to show you. This was low in stock when I bought it, so if they don't have it, I'll link something similar. But it is very pretty. Okay, this is the dress I'm gonna wear um, for the event in Marrakesh with YSL. How perfect is this? I had it, got it for Rob's 30th, never arrived. Then I got it and I was like, I have nothing to even wear it to now, but I just liked it, so I said I'll keep it. And sure, less than two weeks later, we have found something for it. I need help closing the back though. I can't do it. I need like four pairs of hands, but I think it will fit, so yay, sorted. This is also another good option for the event. Um, I think the black, the black dress code might be for both nights. So I think I'll bring both anyway, but uh, it, the fact it's mesh will probably be good in um, 35 degree heat. But yeah, this is from Misguided. I got it before Christmas, so they probably don't still have it, but I'll try and find something similar. But I must rip off this tag. The last time I wore it, I forgot to rip it off. So yeah, let me know which one you think is best. I'm showing you a lot of options. <laughs> Okay, so I'm pretty much packed here. Um, I went to the pharmacy a while ago. My, I thought it was my wisdom tooth was at me because it's really sore like on my gum and it's like moving back to my throat. Um, so I got this Anbasol, which is like a liquid and I got Pongella, so I'm double dosing. But um, I had looked back and I actually got my, my top wisdom teeth out before. I thought it was my bottom, but I got confused. So I don't know what it is but I feel like I'm just being paranoid and starting to think, is it COVID? You know the way now if there's anything wrong with you, you're like, ah, even though I know it's not. And I got the PCR test anyway, so that will tell me in a couple hours time. So hopefully it's not impact now. So that would be very disappointing. So tomorrow I have going for growth in the morning from like half nine to half two, I think. So I have to leave early to get my flight, but I need to do my homework for that now, which is like an organizational chart for Clue. So we did it when we first started like five months ago and now we're doing it again to see how things have changed. So like I've taken on two people since the start of the year 
Um, so it's only when I suppose when you look back like that you see how much you've actually done even when you don't always feel like that, you know, that kind of way. So it's nice, but um, yeah, I'm gonna sit down now and do that and I'm gonna get my content ready for a couple of collaborations that I have to do. Guys, I need to exercise, but I don't want to. But I need to, because I haven't done proper exercise in a while. So I think I'm gonna go to the gym. You know, when you're like out of routine and it's just so much harder, that is me right now. I'm like, I'd rather do anything than go to the gym. But I know I'll feel better for it, so I think I'm gonna go. What do you think? Go. Go. Okay, I'm gonna go. Oh my god, it's raining again. The weather cannot make us mind up today. Got a good workout in. I was in there for like 55 minutes. So that's long for me, so I'm proud of myself. But good news, while I was in there, I got my negative test result. So I'm going to Marrakesh tomorrow, or to Turkey tomorrow, and then laying over there and flying to Marrakesh on Wednesday morning. Yeah. Our sunflower fell over today. So I've taped it to the window. We need to go get sticks for it, but uh, it's just not looking very healthy. Maybe we need to get a tomato juice. A bigger... I wonder, can I buy that in Super Value? Because I don't have time to go to the garden shop. Oh, it's just not looking good, guys. So sad. Now I'm dropping Mark to training and I'm gonna go and get some dinner, cook dinner so that I can have something healthy in my one day at home. Okay, went to Tesco and I'm going, oh my gosh, butter, cause we're out of butter. Um, I'm gonna do like a rocket salad with some chicken, maybe I have in the fridge. Uh, broccoli, asparagus and salmon. Very healthy because I'm only home for one day, so I'm gonna try to be healthy for this day. <laughs> Public service announcement, if you haven't tried this saw, this uh, seasoning, Aromat it's called, it's so good. It just literally makes everything taste nice. So I've put it on the salmon and I've put it on some of the veg and then this is the salad and I boil some eggs and put them on top. It's a whole random compilation of healthy food. Okay, this is what we got. A lot of greens and fish and veg and it's very healthy and it's actually delicious as well. Best part of dinner. I'm having a cupcake. It was sent to me by Spotlight World Care because they have 40% off on their site from today until this day next week. This is not an ad, but they did send me these. It's just like a little press drop. So I said I'd give them a shout out. But um, I'm watching Taylor Swift's speech when she got her honorary doctorate. Uh, you know, I love Taylor Swift. If you follow me, you know I'm obsessed. So it's a nice little break for myself. Um, then I'm gonna go through my bags, make sure everything packed, and I gotta go back and pick up Mark then from training. These are the little cupcakes they sent. It's so good. And 40% off. Good morning, it's Tuesday morning, it's half six. I'm training at seven, or 6.45. Because I have a really busy day today. I have my going for growth at 10 and then I'm going straight to the airport from there. I'm taking my vitamins, I'm taking Team Rain for women because they've got vitamin B in there and I haven't been taking them as regularly as I should be and that's probably why I have these like mouth ulcers. I feel like that's the first sign for me that I'm getting run down. It's just not ideal when you're about to go traveling. <laughs> but I'm gonna take these now anyway and I have my Baraka here too, so loading up on the vitamins so that hopefully these go away. They're like the most painful things. Okay, I'm home. The car is literally fogging off, I'm so sweaty. I actually got a really good workout in, way better than I thought. 
I would um, because I was so tired. Like I literally was falling asleep on the couch at half nine last night. My body is telling me I'm more tired than I even realize I am. <laughs> okay, I've yet to finish doing my hair, but how cute is this outfit? Such a nice blazer. I got, um, I sized up and I just love the kind of oversized look. And then the shorts match as well, even though they don't look like they do on the website. And this little corset top, I just think will be really handy to like mix and match under things in the summer. So I was thinking I would wear this to my meeting this morning, but I might not wear the shorts. I might put on a pair of jeans instead, just cause I'm quite tall. But love this outfit, really happy with it. Okay, I changed into jeans. I think this is better. And we're going to get a coffee before um, I have to leave. Okay, here we go. Next stop, Istanbul. Hello, so I'm in the airport and I just kind of sat in the lounge, got a little bit of work done um, after they're going for growth meeting, which I always find so inspiring. It's good to sit down and kind of get through your to-do list. I always leave after, like with a million things I need to do. Um, there's like six girls at the table. We all have their own um, businesses that they're working on, some further along than others and completely kind of different industries as well. There's like a whiskey company, a period subscription company, period products subscription company. And it's just really cool because we all face the same problems. I always learn so much from it. And more importantly even, I leave feeling like I have a support network and I have help. So yeah, um, we're just about to board here now. Flying to Istanbul tonight and then on to Marrakesh tomorrow for the YSL event, which I'm so excited to see. The first day we are going to see like what they're launching and we have like kind of a content creation moment to get my hair, my, sorry, my makeup done and we're staying in La Nuna, which is where Anna Delby stayed, which is so exciting. And then um, the following day we're going into the desert and they have like a desert camp, which I just think is going to be insane. It's very hot over there, so I've packed for that. But yeah, um, check in on my next vlog to see what we actually get up to. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this kind of short little catch-up vlog from home. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.